let's look at China's latest step forward in autonomous driving. Last week, China issued its first L3-level autonomous driving license plate in Chongqing, officially allowing L3 functionality on public roads for the first time. Meanwhile, China's Ministry of Industry and Information Technology announced two vehicle models equipped with L3 autonomous driving functions designed respectively for urban congestion scenarios and highway driving, and these vehicles will conduct road trials in designated areas in Beijing and Chongqing. This marks another step in China's transition of L3 autonomous driving technology from testing into commercial application. L3 autonomous driving is classified as conditional automation. Under specific conditions and scenarios, the vehicle can independently perform dynamic driving tasks such as steering controls, speed regulation, and road environment perception. However, the driver must remain ready to take over control at any time. At present, all mass-produced and widely sold autonomous driving vehicles on the road, including those from Tesla, remain at L2 level. The core difference between L3 and L2 lies in the shift of liability. In L2 systems, driving responsibility always rests with the user. In L3 systems, if an accident occurs within the system's operational capability and the driver fails to take over in time, liability may fall on the automaker or the system supplier. If the accident is caused by the driver's failure to fulfill takeover obligations, the user may bear primary responsibility. The shift in responsibility implies higher technical requirement and stricter regulation oversight. Accordingly, China requires applicant models to pass rigorous product testing and safety evaluations, including key criteria such as front-installed mass-produced sensors, data security protection, and cybersecurity verification. During road operation, trial vehicles are limited to government-designated areas and must be equipped with safety drivers or remote monitoring systems to handle emergencies. Fu Bingfeng, Executive Vice President of the China Association of Automobile Manufacturers, believes that the China's autonomous vehicle industry is accelerating its transition from technology validation to a new stage of mass production application.